fuck. I forgot. My mic was off. But, uh... Welcome back to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Let's go meet with King Flan. Oh my god. I hate you. Stop serpentining! Alright, fuck it. Thank you. Welcome back to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Let's go meet with Flan. See what he's up to. See what he needs from us. of knowledge where are you it's wait it's below me how how do I get down there there's got to be some place to enter Wait, okay, so it's somewhere around here. Aha! boys oh come on am i stuck really just go down it's like it's like a two foot not even two foot drop come on god has heard my prayers you flatter me lord but what's wrong where's barith he's not returned nor have two messengers sent after him this cannot be simple misfortune it hints at some dark design let me go after him lord if he lives, I will find him. Even with your cunning and guile, you would not go unchallenged. Not without a king's pass, and few Vikings have those. I'd wager a few from Donegal do. Donegal? A Norse settlement? A port, on the western shore. A fair bit of their trade finds its way to Aliach, so someone there is bound to have a pass. Is this port well guarded? It's crawling with Norsemen grown lazy on success. They'd not expect someone to go Viking on them. Good. I'll go to Donegal now and get one of these passes. With your leave, Lord. If it means fewer lives lost, you have my blessing. Okay, so I've raided Donegal, like, a few times now. It's actually kind of insane how many times I have. I literally just came from there. Oh shit. I didn't get that fast from- God damn it! Okay, it's alright. <laughs> nah, it's not. I'm pissed at myself. For doing that by accident. Because I'm- It's so fucking hot in here. <laughs> alright. Off we go. Where's my cat? What happened to my cat? Run up the stairs! 
that makes me mad. What the fuck happened to my cat? Sing my ravens. Actually, no. Is there a sea skull among you? Unor the Ugly was an excellent sailor who could pilot a longship entirely on his own. This is why King Sigvaldi kept him around. In all other matters, Unar was a cruel, anxious, and humorless man. He was one of the most unlikable people I have ever known. <laughs> one year, I recall we had invited some carls from the Ingling clan to dine with us. As we were serving ale, we came to find that we had none left. It so happened that the ale had run out just before reaching Unar's horn. This raised in him a word storm, and he accused Sigvaldi of treachery. Every man in the longhouse jeered at Unar for raising such a fuss. This made Unar angrier than before. He stormed out. Save it for later. Speaking of storming, let's storm to the go. These snow scales have grown fat and dull. Give them a real raid while I hunt down a king's pass. <laughs> yes! We take their silver! And show them Odin's Hall! Since we're here, we might as well just burn the whole thing to the ground. Stronger already. Watch my back. How are you just gonna pick up somebody else's oh, shit? Survivor. Okay, so where do I need to go? So I need to go here. We've got a fast travel point here. And I can do that as well.
Okay. So, from here, really a good path anywhere, is it? But I might be able to get, uh, get down from here. business have you here the business of kings here's my pass go on then oh god who are you to come before the kings of Ilar unannounced <laughs> Fergal you're not Fergal uh, I don't know you I am Sturm of Donegal who is Fergal the king of Dublin speaks of a cousin who advised us for a time a glorified goat herder who should have taken our advice. So, Stern, what brings a Viking from Donegal here? You tell me. I came at your invitation. There's some mistake. I sent no such message. It wasn't me. It could have been you know who. But he hates Vikings. Forgive my brother's bluntness. We will get to the root of this, I assure you. Can I offer you a drink? Yes? More drink? I haven't seen the bottom of my cup since I got here. <laughs> if I wasn't a trusting man, I'd say they're trying to keep me drunk. No drink for me. I'll return when you have finished your king's business. If it's not drink you're wanting, you should take a tour of the ring fort. It's, it's renowned throughout the land. As we've told you several times, King Barth, the Ring Fort of Arla is not open to guests. In fact, you could even say that it's closed for a select few. Ah, so you're keeping prisoners there. <laughs> oh, have a drink, you two. Do you think I haven't taken a few hostages myself? I'll seek out a place to rest until you remember why I was summoned here. Of course, of course. Your pass will grant you free run of this place. If you see Fergal, say hello for me. For the last time, Bart, the ring fort is off limits. Okay, wow, he's sloshed. If I read Barth right, freeing 
Fergal could be key to liberating Arlech. And to do that, I need to get inside that fort. He's utterly sloshed. He's gone. What's wrong with you? My pass won't get me into that ring fort. I'll need to find another way. Oh, come on. Am I stuck? Might be the key. No, that's not the key. He has the key. The question is, how do I get to him? Oh, no. Well, that... Did it. Someone here named Fergal. I am he. Who wants to know, Viking? I serve Barith MacKeever and King Sean Shinna. They offer you freedom. Well, that was quick. Wait. I have to press. Trying to get the door open. Hey, wait! So kind. Thank you, my friend. Come on. Here we go. Yes, I don't speak Irish. Or I guess Gaelic. Hey, you're Ava, right? You served us. We were meant to check on the king and report back. But soldiers grabbed us and threw us in here. I'll let you out. Return to King Flan if you can. Secure the prison. How does one do that? Stretch your wings. Like, like kill all the enemies? Hey. 
Just invading the city, okay. Put it here. Won't take long. Remain steadfast. Going to the word. Throw it. Let's see. Can't hold out much longer. Yeah. Oh, You're geez. going down. Excellent, excellent. Join us, cousin. We've been having a grand old time, the kings and I. It's the abbot who's turned this place into a prison. He's taken hostages from all the families to control all of Ireland. Shut your gab, Donald. Owen would kill you if you talk too much. And Flan will kill us if we don't. It's like Donald said. It was Owen. He told us to delay whoever came until... Until what? Until the abbot can move his forces in. How many men? How many? We don't know. No one does. He has some companies at Armagh, more men than he lets on. That's all I know. Left to my cousin, you'd both be puddles of blood and guts. But King Flan might spare your heads. You'll be treated as hostages, not prisoners. Until your king decides what to do with you. Now, think on your sins. It'll be easier in the end to let them keep their crowns, but... They don't need to know that yet. Flan must learn of this trap. I've already sent messengers telling him to pull his army back. I wasn't going to sit on my arse waiting for you. I'm impressed. Don't be. It took days of drinking that swill before Neil finally grew bored and careless. You've outdone yourself. I'll be sure to let the king know who the real hero was today. Thanks to you, cousin. Make sure that message reached Flan and I'll join you all later. May Sol and Mauni guide ye. Okay. So since we're here and we have control of the city, might as well try to get all of the stuff. There's a way in.
Doubt I'm supposed to be able to need to get on the other side. Do it from in here, right? But it doesn't seem like there's a uh, another hello. Okay, so there's that. There was a great somewhere. Bunch of other stuff here too. I'm gonna go here. Fuck. I knew I should have gotten this. Wait, why am I getting on the ship? Don't need to do that. Just gotta go speak to Flan. Where's my horse? Oh, wow. Okay. You sound like you're appearing from behind me. You don't appear at all, and then appear. Appear from the side, directly ahead of me. Alright, note to self no matter what he says, I need to get that fast trouble point over there. Because likely the mission will not teleport me elsewhere. going on. <gasps> Looks like he's talking to someone. Eivor, you did well at Alec. We marched in the morning. I think it no small thing for you to lead my honor guard. Did you not get Barret's message, Lord? You must pull back, not move forward. This ruse is part of a larger trap, not yet sprung. Barith believes to know the minds of these kings, but the church has taken root and flourished since my uncle's day. The church is behind the plot against you. Did the message say nothing of Abbot Owen? King Neil and King Donal were doubtless seeking a cast blame elsewhere. The church is a convenient scapegoat. What if there's some truth to Barith's suspicions? Owen is the Abbot of Armagh. God's appointed in Ireland. I cannot doubt him on the word of him friend you mean a pagan why are you all still here did my message not get through it did but king flan is not convinced you must pull out the clawer now my king before we are surrounded by owen's army 
You do not command me, Barth McKeever. If there was an army, my scouts... Your scouts are dead. Baldur's blood flown. How many must die before you learn to trust? You forget yourself, Barth. Do not invoke your false gods in my presence. Listen, what's that? Owen's wolves have arrived. I didn't come this far to die in a tent, my king. We're under attack! Come on! Off to war we go. In the heart of the village! Take you! You're going to catch the new cousin! Do not wager on it! Grant me strength! If we hold off this assault, we will save the day! Go! Oh shit. With me. We can use your help, Keeper. Come with me! I'll be your shield. <laughs> There's so many more of them. all gonna drop dead.
We okay. held them off. At a great cost. Eivord, where is Boris? Boris! Can you hear me? Oh shit, is he dead? Boris McKeever! Have you seen King Boris? Aye. He was headed towards the farm on the edge of the village. A cold hand that grips my heart. End, don't you think? Worthy of a saga, maybe. And you thought I'd gone soft. No one knew your true measure. Not even you, cousin. <coughs> you had your doubts. Good thing I was too stupid to give up. <coughs> your bravery will be remembered, Barth. I'll see to it. Hold your weapon well, cousin. I will see you in Valhalla. Sigfrith is my Valhalla, Eivor. Valhalla need not be a place. It can be a legacy. Flan must back him. Have him swear by his god. There's nothing the Christians fear more than their almighty's wrath. Be done. The hero's funeral. Aerith has become a greater man in death than he was in life. Or maybe we were too small to see his full size. A harsh truth. <laughs> but fair. He saw more clearly than I, and I ignored his counsel. Owen will pay for his death. What then? When the abbot is gone and you've tamed the north, what of Siegfried? Will you give him your royal support? When he has proven himself. It would not be good politics at this time. Trolls take your politics. Barith gave his life in your service. If this is how you repay loyalty, you'll be in short supply. Twice you stung me with truth. I'll return the favor. Siegfried isn't ready. But he could be, with proper teaching. Good. He'll benefit from your wisdom. And my support. But neither throne will be secure while Owen lives. We'll throttle the snake. And afterward... The fate of this land will be in your hands. Your and Siegfried. The horses are being made ready, my king. Sure you don't want to rest your bones and leave by dawn's light? My thoughts ride too rough for sleep. I have an army and reputation to reclaim. The second may prove harder than the first. My mother used to tell me how the Morrigan would feed on the death of heroes, then fill men's heads with thoughts of war. I imagined using the Tara Stone to drown out their song, the way Bishop Patrick drove the snakes from Ireland. There is no power strong enough to do what you say. Not even the gods can change fate. The world is destined to end in war. It was not but the fantasy of a young girl, so... Tell Flon I'll come to him after I've arranged things with Siegfried. Tell him yourself. I'm not leaving yet. Okay. The wages of war. Okay, sweet. At least far from... Oh! Oh, that makes sense. I, I know where we are. Um, speak to Siegfried. Okay, I think we'll do that when we return. So, I thank you so very much, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, for joining me. If you like what you saw and you're on YouTube, please like, comment, subscribe. On Twitch, drop me a follow if you haven't already. And I will see you all tomorrow.